Hi everyone and welcome to another campsite tour. We've moved along the Cornish coast and we're now just outside Coverack, only about a mile outside the little fishing village. It's lovely and quiet, great to sit and look out over the bay. We've sat there and uh, bought a coffee and just relaxed really. The site we're at is Specky Wood. It's a CL for the Caravan and Motorhome Club. So it means it only has a limited number of pitches for the caravan club section. It's a little bit larger because it has some additional fields. Uh, it's quite a simple site. So I'll show you around very quickly and you get an idea of what it's like. So if we come in through the main entrance here, on the right is the bungalow for the owners. And that's where you go and check in. And the main entrance is straight down here. If we carry on down here to the entrance, that barn there is for tractors and other maintenance equipment. In fact, I was talking to the owner and he said with all this weather they've been having here, it's still a struggle to sort out the grass in the field. So at the moment they're not being used, but I'll show you them anyway. We've got one field here with looks like quite a few electric points here on the right and here on the left. And then you go through to the next one and he's been uh, rolling these in the last few days while the weather stayed dry try and get them in some sort of shape to be used later on in the season it's quite a big field that one again with electric hookup turn round come back down you'll see just the right of that hedge is an L-sand point and then we'll continue down towards the area where we are which is the hard standing section show you this building here this houses two showers separate showers both with toilets and they are prioritized for people with smaller vans so you book ahead and ask for access to the shower you get a key and that becomes yours they have as i said a shower and a toilet and i'll show you inside the one we've got in a second so that's the key for the shower room just open the door up so we'll just come into the shower room as i said you have your own key for use in the shower it's actually got toilet wash basin and that's the shower it's not metered but you pay extra for booking the shower room and it makes it a uh, 25 pound a night for pitch electric and shower just up here is a separate toilet so if the shower is being used by somebody you can access a toilet there and we'll come up here here on the right there's drinking water and this is also the waste area so you've got recycling general waste and L sand and then if we come up here this is the section with hard standing all look like they've got access to hook up these three here on this side of the hedge and then the remainder here a couple of statics at the back there but then the rest are hard standing for touring there's a field as well which I think gets used in the same way. The other thing you'll notice, we've all got hedges between the pitches. That's always a nice feature for a bit more privacy and they're just growing up now. So that is Specky Wood. Very small, uh, very quiet and relaxing. There's not much noise at all around here. And it's only a very short walk into Coverack. And also we've managed to track down a sculpture park. It takes a bit of finding but it's well worth the effort because it's quite a unique site really seeing these sculptures in the middle of nowhere in a couple of meadows. So let's a quick look around the Specky Wood CL campsite. Hope you found it useful and until our next tour
Bye for now. Good morning, everybody. On a lovely sunny day, although the wind's a little bit chilly. Because, yeah, it is. But we're in Kovarak on the Lizard Peninsula. And this morning, we're going out on the bikes for a coffee, of course. But then we're going to walk around the coast for 10 minutes to the uh, Terence Coventry Sculpture Park, which actually is just a couple of fields over there but you have to follow the path, obviously. Um, it's beautiful. What can I say? We're so pleased to have caught the sunshine, aren't we? We are, Yeah. after all that rain. Yeah, yeah, although I think the rain might be coming back, but we're up for it. So um, yeah, that's it for today. And you can follow us on our little trip so you can see the lovely scenery around here. Coverack's a lovely fishing town, which has still got a privately fisherman-owned harbour, hasn't it? Yes. And last time we came, it was absolutely ram full of fishing boats. In fact, the owner of this site, um, does he do crab fishing? I think he's a crab fisherman, yes. Yeah, and he's had some interesting tales to tell, didn't he, about he did. being in a lifeboat for three days at sea when his ship sank. And, and he's still going out there and doing it. Amazing. Anyway, enjoy your day. Well, we've just left the bikes and we are now on the southwest coast path trying to find the sculpture park see what we can see it's a glorious day today the winds dropped and the sun is shining so we're just coming out of coverack and we'll follow the path A drive. It would be pretty steep, wouldn't it? It would. Mind you, you have to work with what you got round here. You do. So that's the old hall that was being worked on. It's all been yeah. done now. It's the chapel, isn't it? Old chapel. Wesleyan chapel, no less. Out of the Welsh. I like the chapels. Yes. Wind is now either dropped or it's less cold. These are dinky places. Some have got some little bay windows. Perfect location for them. I'm not sure what those are. Not bad for your view. 